this morning and then stepped out later this afternoon and you're like, oh, wow, it feels a lot colder. Because it was. Wow. <laughs> we had falling temperatures all day today. We started off with a lot of cloud coverage. This is a time lapse from our Kokomo cam. Heavy cloud coverage, even a few light flurries here and there. No accumulation with that this morning, but that very heavy uh, snow cover we have across the area did lead the way to the clear skies eventually this afternoon as high pressure was building in. But right now in Kokomo, it is bitter cold. At one above, we have a breeze out of the west at 12 miles per hour. The skies are clear still, and that wind chill value, it feels like it's 16 below zero. Downtown Indianapolis, quiet with the blanket of snow along the circle, four degrees, and still those breezy winds right now making it feel like it is 14 below zero. So the skies clear out a bunch in north central Indiana. We still have some clouds in south central Indiana, so the temperatures are a little bit warmer there, although it's hard to consider eight degrees in Greensburg as warm. But it's three right now in Anderson, zero in Lafayette and Crawfordsville. And we are tracking the possibility of some record breaking temperatures. The coldest maximum high for Sunday is 11 degrees. That was set back in 1976. For New Year's Day, two degrees was the coldest maximum record. That was back in 1928. And we are also tracking New Year's Day morning to be the coldest since January the 8th of 2015. And then we factor in the wind chill values where they will be running 10 to 25 degrees below zero tonight through Tuesday evening. Forecast lows tonight will be below zero in most locations, down to four below in Indianapolis. And tonight during the overnight, we'll see the clouds returning. In fact, we have the possibility of some light snow showers tomorrow morning into early afternoon. And then temperatures will struggle to climb to near 10 degrees in Indianapolis with single digit highs in many locations in north central Indiana. So that blanket of snow is going to help keep us very cold. And then as we get into New Year's Eve night, it will be brutally cold with those temperatures falling very quickly and wind chills will be running 15 to 20 below zero midnight tomorrow night. So if you're heading out for New Year's Eve celebrations, make sure you bundle up. We will see the air temperature around two degrees during that eight o'clock hour running two below at midnight with those clear and cold skies. As we get into Monday, tracking temperatures into the single digits for afternoon highs, it will be a blustery day. It will be sunny and dry, however. So as we get into uh, your afternoon, we will see those temperatures climbing. Let me get this uh, correct seven day here for you because that is not the right one. Uh, we do have very cold temperatures as we head into the evening hours tonight. We'll eventually fall to four below zero first thing tomorrow morning, high of 10 degrees tomorrow afternoon. A few flurries will be possible. And then as we get into New Year's Day, high of just five above. So brutally cold could be breaking a record for the coldest maximum. Seven the high for Tuesday. Those wind chills will be running 15 to 25 below zero Monday and Tuesday.